Flooding in Vietnam is a very serious and concerning problem. It is an issue that affects nearly all areas of the country every year. During the rainy season, heavy rains can cause rivers and streams to overflow, while monsoons in the fall and winter can also bring flooding. The problem is compounded by the fact that much of the land has become overdeveloped and urbanized, creating a lack of open space for water to drain into. It has been estimated that over 1 million hectares of land in Vietnam are prone to flooding each year. Flooding in Vietnam can have a major impact on the country's economy, as it disrupts transportation, trade, and industry. It also has a negative effect on crop yields, as wet fields can lead to rotten crops. The flooding also gives rise to spread of disease, polluted water supply, destroyed housing, and casualties. Sadly, Vietnam has seen some of the most devastating floods in all of Asia in recent years. Flooding has caused extensive damage, and many people have lost family members, homes, and livelihoods as a result. For those living in affected areas, the regular floods can be a major obstacle to creating a better life. The government of Vietnam is aware of the problem, and is taking steps to reduce flooding. This includes strengthening levees, dredging rivers, and building new reservoirs and dams. The government is also working with other countries in the Mekong region to come up with solutions to mitigate the impact of flooding. Additionally, the government is encouraging people to practice conservation and to plant trees, so that the land will have more diverse sources of water for use throughout the year. Other initiatives include strengthening embankments and constructing dikes to protect riverbanks from erosion. NGOs and international organizations are also providing assistance to those affected by flooding, including providing food, shelter, and psychological counseling. In order to really tackle flooding in Vietnam, the entire community must come together to implement sustainable practices. This includes creating more efficient land use plans, increasing public awareness about the issue, and better resource management. People must also be mindful about the impact they are having on their environment, and take steps to reduce pollution and prevent deforestation. Flooding in Vietnam is a serious problem, but with the right measures in place, it can be addressed. Solutions need to be both top-down and bottom-up, and everyone must do their part to work together and ensure that everyone is safe from the threat of floods. Local governments, NGOs, and international groups all have an important role to play in helping to reduce flooding. Vietnam is a country with a long history of flood mitigation, and it will take a collective effort to find solutions that work. Education is key, as raising public awareness about the dangers of flooding can help to reduce its impact.